up, everybody? So today we're going to be talking about Quill. I'm going to give a review. I had, I've been with Quill for a year now. So Quill is a Net30 vendor that offers office supplies such as paper, pens, electronics, you know, you name it. Um, the requirement uh, to be approved for Quill is you must be in business for 30 days. Um, some of the pros that I love is they have a lot of products to choose from. So we're going to go ahead right here. So they offer everything from cleaning supplies all the way up to like printer stuff, help and care stuff. It's a lot to choose from. So if I was anyone, I would definitely start with Quill because a lot of the stuff on, on this website you will be able to use. The con to Quill is you have to make a hundred dollar purchase. A hundred dollars is a lot, you know, especially if you're funding this through like a nine to five or like savings. It, it is a lot, but it's worth it. Um, they report to Dun and Bradstreet and Experian. They report each month and they also report a trade line. So when you sign up, they get offer you a trade line along you know and then they once you make your hundred dollar purchase they report that to the credit bureau too so that's always good but overall i give quill a 10 even if i wasn't in business i would probably still use quill just because uh the amount of stuff they ship so like it's kind of reminds me of like a sam's club just a little bit more expensive but you know i, I buy household stuff like uh, paper towels and just mops like cleaning supplies there's a whole bunch of stuff here I bought an off uh, a chair from here so I 100% believe that you should get this especially like your first five within your first five net 30s definitely go for quilt but if this helped like comment subscribe and I'll be posting a video every day until the year is out have a blessed one